Come on. Yeah. 出发 Three young people are on a pilgrimage that will take them 800 kilometers in just 12 days. 男主角的儿子就是死在这个地方。Follow your heart and go where it tells you to go. You don't want to choose a kind of life, but you want to live a kind of life. Cheers. Your love and dreams should be your only guide. This is Chao Zheng Chu's power. Traveling thousands of miles in pursuit of the beauty of life. No se necesita una escalera grande. 加油，合作！还有五公里。Will a pilgrimage rooted in the soul light up a journey with the dreams of youth? August 2014. Time for Xie Bojie and his partners to begin the 800-kilometer journey. From Saint Jean Pied de Port in France to Santiago de Compostela in Spain, they're about to attempt the Way of Saint James, Europe's time-honored Pilgrim's Way, a route imbued with the history and culture of medieval Europe. I'm 超福欢的朋友对这个方面感兴趣，就和我们一起来参加了这个活动。Are you the father of Daniel Avery? Yes, I am. 我看过一部电影，就叫《朝圣之路》。这个电影呢，讲的就是一对父子之间的故事，穿插在过程中间的，就是这条朝圣之路。就去想去了解一下，是不是我也可以走电影中拍的这个地方。So, first, name, name? Yes. first objective on their journey to get the special passports of the way. Once these have been stamped, their journey has officially begun. The main function of these passports is not about crossing international frontiers, but rather about proving that pilgrims have stopped at every point along the way. Wow, nice. If you want the shell, can you see the shell? Okay. You give anything you want, okay? Shells are a traditional part of the pilgrimage. Back in the Middle Ages, travelers who successfully finished the way would bring a shell back home from the sea near the destination. Over the years, shells came to symbolize the way. Though most people choose to walk, cycling is allowed along the pilgrimage route. Watch out, though; it's often necessary to ride off-road. And to pick a path through forests, so you need to be an experienced cyclist. 绝大多数人在绝大多数时候都是迷茫的，去这个线路其实也是怀着这样一种迷茫和探索的这想法。Day one, one of the most difficult sections of the whole journey, getting over the Pyrenees. Pushing a bicycle weighed down with 30 kilograms of luggage up steep slopes doesn't exactly make things easier. We've reached this place. Seeing this road and that road, we should go along the road. 
，而应该沿着这中间的这条草地往上走过去，也就是没有路的。在美国的那部电影《朝圣之路》里头，男主角的儿子就是死在这个地方。有看过那个电影的话，到这儿还觉得蛮。The movie *The Way* starts with a tragedy that kicks off a spiritual journey during which everyone finds the things they need. By dusk, they're arriving at their first stopping off point and getting ready to spend the night in a post house attached to a monastery. The number of their bed. You see? Okay. This is. 他去住的本来那地方呢，他已经满了。然后呢，所以我们现在跟这位 lady 呢去一个特别老的建筑。他说 very special. 啊，所以我们来看一下什么地方呢 ？Ten o'clock is the light. The light is open. In all Chinese, Chinese, Chinese. Yes, all people sleeping. Travelers from all over the world find rest after a hard day's walking on these neatly arranged bunk beds. These hostels are run by volunteers, so a bed doesn't cost much. Lights out. Many of the worn-out travelers are falling asleep. The pace of the church post house is always the same, governed by the sound of the chimes of sacred bells. The day starts at 6 a.m. But many pilgrims are already enjoying the early morning light. To complete this pilgrimage, you need great strength and perseverance. By 10 a.m. on day two, they arrive at the small town of Pamplona. It's a place that vividly illustrates one of the main difficulties of finishing the route. There's so much to see along the way that it's sometimes difficult to make progress. It seems that both bull running and the pilgrimage play an important role in the identity of this place. It just so happens that their visit coincides with the bull running festival, and one heart-stopping running event has only just come to an end. They'll have to make do with listening to songs and imagining how crazy and exciting the event was. Ernest Hemingway is probably the writer to turn to. To discover more about the bull running festival. In Madeira, there is a bar that is written that Hemingway has never eaten here before. Because there are too many people who are there saying that Hemingway has eaten here before, that Hemingway has drunk here before. So today we brought a real one. Hemingway has really been here, eaten some food, eaten some coffee. Cheers. 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 But as the terrain begins to gently slope over the Pyrenees mountains, disaster strikes. 早上起来的时候，发现这个轮胎就突然没气了，不知道为什么。Luckily, an elderly person from Sweden stops to lend a hand. 这个老爷爷不是自己来骑车的，他的目的实际上是陪他的太太。他的太太呢，很早很早就想徒步走这条路。终于在退休之后有时间过来去完成他的一个心愿。这个老爷爷觉得不放心，他就想了一个折中的办法，就是你徒步，我骑车陪着你。Thank you, thank you very much. 
Camino. See ya. 其实路上就是这种小事，蛮打动人。这是朝圣之路的魅力吧。The unexpected encounters they have on the road are another thing that makes the journey memorable. Take this white-haired and white-bearded old man, for example. He's walked the way twice. Now he's decided to stay here and provide services for other travelers. He started doing the Camino when he was 17. He said that then in 1976, when he did it again, there were 13 pilgrims in total that whole year who finished the Camino. There were no albergues. Everyone slept under bridges, took showers every now and then in the rivers, and there were no paths, especially for pilgrims. So you had to walk alongside the trucks and the roads and everything. Ah. How many years does he work for here? Seventeen years. Seventeen years. Yes, but he says you have to be a little bit crazy to come here every day. Ah. We, China. Yeah. China. To you. This is a gift from China. Yeah. Love you. The Chinese knot might be the very first gift from China the old man has ever got. Goodbye. As their journey takes them through many cities and villages, they are never alone on the way. As the terrain changes from steep mountains to gentle rolling hills, they've reached today's target on schedule, Lagrano. Nighttime in Lagrano is full of temptations. The smell of wine reaches every corner. The bars are full of Spanish people doing what they love best: tasting wine and sampling snacks. They stand at the bar, chatting and laughing loudly, before moving on to another place. The three youngsters opt to emulate the locals. After all. When in Rome, do as the Romans. With the mountains behind them, they continue their journey through expanses of fields and low rolling hills. Chie Bourdieu. Is worried that riding their bikes over cobbled roads with such heavy burdens is going to take its toll on the bikes. Time to optimize them before they move on. Just as Xie Bojiu is working on his own bike. Two Spanish cyclists get flat tires. No, that is not a solution. We just help them. It's actually very simple. One small thing, but this small thing is very helpful for them. Because on that road, there is no help. Then it is used as a road. If they don't help, they can just walk. They can't push it. Then they can just walk. Then they can just walk. Under the shell guide board, these cyclists start on their way once more, all enjoying the same heartwarming sunlight. 七八九十十一十二，啊，我们已经盖了十二张了。那你来看一下，这是一个几乎不管人在所有的长途路上，应该把所有张都盖过。我们数不过来了已经。然后里边我最喜欢的张应该是这个，就这个带贝壳这个张。我现在还不太确定这个张可以在哪里盖到，有可能是在终点，希望后面能够碰到它。People complete the way in their own style and at their own pace. Everyone stops at different places and gets different stamps. Everyone acquires their own memories and stories to tell. Slowly, slowly, you will meet more people, more people. You will find things happen. You will understand. Actually, they are like this. When you listen to their stories, you will also feel that every person has their own style of life. Every person has their own style of life. Every person has their own style of life. 因为这条线路有一个给定的目标，就会让你知道我人可以是一种什么状态
，如果这个事情就是你想要的，就没有关系，你就去承受这条路上所带来的痛苦和体验。这种心态和体验，就是我能够带回来到日常生活里头去的。To San Diego de Compostela. From here. Ah. Ah. Okay. 离圣地亚哥洪波斯特拉有七百九十公里，走了也快一半。今天会完成一半。嗯，加油。耶，出发。After passing the midpoint, they come to a place so small that you can't even find it on the map. Some say it has a population of just five. But even so, it plays host to an important post house. Then we give you breakfast tomorrow morning mm -hmm. at half oh. past six, so you wake up with the smell of the coffee. Oh, nice! Right. And uh, the staff member briefing them is not a native. She's also one of the pilgrims. When she arrived here, she decided to stay for two weeks as a volunteer before carrying on with her journey. You will get to the showers over there. Over there, yes. And the bathroom. Good. On the left. The stop provides them with a good chance to treat any cuts, scratches, and grazes. As other post houses, it's run by volunteers, so accommodation here is very cheap. They need to prepare dinner by themselves. As night falls, travelers from various countries compete to show off their cooking skills. Chie Bo Zhi doesn't hold out hope that his inferior culinary skills will draw many people's attention. Finally, 7 a.m. The moment of truth, dinner time. <laughs> Will anyone like this wonderful Chinese dish? Thank After dinner, everyone sings along to the familiar tune of Frere Jacques. Everybody has their own version of this song. Still, everyone is united by the tune. Before hitting the road again, it's time to put money in the donation box to make sure that when other people come here, they'll receive just as warm a welcome. These travelers will take their own paths. Maybe they'll meet again at the journey's end. Or maybe they'll never see each other again. But one thing's for sure, they'll never forget. Pilgrims coming from all over the world often bring stones with them. They put the stones down somewhere along the route. 
This symbolizes that they've put some of the emotions that have burdened them in their lives behind them. Each stone in this heap represents a story, the letting go of something that someone has been clinging to. On one level, a road is simply a connection between two places. But walking this road means so much more. Here, the journey takes place in the heart and soul. The last day has come. For the first time, they see Santiago de Compostela standing at the top of this humble hill. There is a sense of excitement, of happiness. Journey's end is in sight. For 800 kilometers, these people have been united in hardship. Now, they are gathered together in joy in Santiago Cathedral Square. Wherever they came from, whether they met along the way, here they all are at the destination that once seemed so far away. People are cheering, hugging, kissing and crying. During this long journey, they came closer to the profound emotions that they wanted to express or experienced new stories of their own. Now here they all are, reborn, renewed by this amazing experience. The road extends to Fistera, where a marker indicates that it's zero kilometers to the destination. In the direction indicated by the last of the shells, the cyclists doff their helmets in a solemn recognition of what they achieved, reflecting on the road they've traveled and the roads that lie ahead of them in the years to come.